Okay, so we arrived. We asked for a manager to meet me in electronics. He came over here. I introduced myself. I'm Day with Falcon. We're here to move the Samsung TV wall. I need you to print a planogram. It'll let me know where to move the Samsung wall. He went and printed it. He came out. I explained the process that we will need to remove these sections over here that it's being moved to. In the process of discussing this, we noticed this huge electrical box right where we're going to move our display. So obviously that poses a problem and that's not a decision that he can make and it's not something that can be made tonight. That's something that would take an electrician to move the box or they have to change their placement of the Samsung wall. So what do I do? I need to get pictures showing everything. So we take pictures of the whole entire wall from the left from the middle and from the right. So I'm going to do that for you on camera so that you can see exactly how these pictures have to be taken. You want to get behind me? So basically all we're trying to do is follow this formula. We want to get the whole thing in focus. The whole thing in the screen in one shot. One from the left, which is just about right here. So pay attention to your camera you have the whole thing in focus I can get the bottom to the top except for this cabinet in front of me that's why I take one from the center so I keep it in focus take your time square off your camera show off your work that's what you're looking for the whole thing in square and I can see all the way around the edge. And then I'm gonna to go to the right. Again, the whole thing in focus, as much in there as I can get. And now, even though I have obstructions from the left, center, and right, with all three of them together, there's not one place on this display that they weren't able to see before we started doing anything. It serves a couple of purposes. It lets them know where it was when we started. We're going to do the same thing when we move it so they can see where it is when we finish. Also, it lets us see what's on the TVs. There's a couple things I can tell you right now that you notice. One, the top right TV is not working. Why isn't it working? Does it not have power or is there a problem? When we plug it in, it doesn't power up. Now we have evidence we didn't break the TV. It wasn't working when we got here. We were or were not able to fix it. Do they have another one on the floor that we can put up there? If they do, we simply swap them out, put the broken TV inside the box, label it defective, and they'll send it back and we put the new TV up. If they do not have one, we'll leave this TV down because there's no sense putting a broken TV back up. Now, the bottom TV, you notice the bottom right TV is playing different content than the other three TVs. That means that the demo mode is playing on this TV. So watch the video on proper content and we'll show you how to change it.